another video and today I have an exciting video because I have just recently gone to Bali. I actually saw wild like hermit crabs living in their natural habitat and this is absolutely amazing and I'll show some footage as I talk but we found the hermit crabs and they had such an amazing environment and it gave me a lot of um, a lot of inspiration and what I can put in my new tank when I get it. And the hermit crabs that I saw there were Ecuadorians and there was also some strawberries, a few of them. And some of them, most of them were actually really, really tiny. It was so cute. And the hermit crabs were situated on the beach and they had, they lived under like a mangrovey type tree thing. Um, I'll show some footage now of their natural habitat and I'll list some of the things so it can give you some inspiration about how to treat your hermit crabs, like how to give them the right care. Climbing and hiding. Rocks, sand, dirt, tree roots, trees, dead coral pieces, ocean, and people's houses which are very near to the crabs. Food, coral pieces, dead sea animals, seaweed, rotting wood slash driftwood, sea life, dead crabs, any other washed up things, a poop of other animals, and sand. Creatures living near, squirrels, crabs, sea snails, humans, sea urchins, fish, rats, and mice. There could be others, but this is what I found. And also, for some people who find it hard to understand why you have to have a g really good habitat for your hermit crabs, this is why. This is because they have a huge, big, natural environment, and we need to try and imitate that as best as we can if we're going to keep them. But if we aren't going to try and imitate their environment and give them the best life they can, it's my opinion that we shouldn't be owning them. Like, if you don't do that, then you probably shouldn't um, own them, because... A plastic critter keeper with some pebbles isn't going to sustain them. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you would like to leave a like and a comment and feel free to subscribe. Also have a good day or if it's night then have a great night. <laughs> Goodbye!